What's up guys, it's Connor from Mods Gaming and uh, I'm doing another video on the Divine RPG mod today uh, as requested by 125 Video Gamer he wanted me to show you guys the last two dimensions in the mod uh, the dimensions are the Isekia dimension and the Dungeon of Arcana dimension that's the, that's the dungeon and the snow one is the ice kia. To make the ice one, you're gonna want to put snow in the regular corner pattern, like this. And same as always, you're just gonna light it with a twilight clock. In the dimension, there's uh, new mobs, and uh, I don't know if you can call them villagers. But uh, people you can trade with that live in the dimension. And you can trade with them and get cool items and upgrade stuff. This is what I saw. And to make the dungeon of Arcana, you're going to have to have blue fire stone and blocks of iron. Put in a pattern like this to craft them. Uh, each one crafts one, so you're going to want 12 of everything. So that and the crafting table and it will make this. You put it in just like a, an ender portal. You put the blocks like that and it will just make the portal automatically. You don't have to light it with a twilight clock or anything. Uh, sometimes it won't light actually. The portal won't show up right when you place it. So you just have to keep replacing them all and place them again and over and over until it works. I know I had to do this one about 15 times before it finally lit. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and go into this the ice, ice Kia. I don't really know how to pronounce it. Takes a while. This, uh, this is the easiest dimension to master, actually, like, conquer and get through. But it, it's still really hard. Oh, that's not this one or the next one of these. Okay. So as you can see there's like a little village here. So you can come in here. I don't know why there's nothing in the These are the guys you can trade with. You can get uh so you can upgrade from that to that. That, that, and all these different things you can get. You uh, pay them, I guess, with snowflakes. All those different things you can get. And the Christmas tree. Yay, Christmas trees. Yay. This guy gives you different stuff. Santa helmet, yes. Santa stuff. Eggnog, yum. Chocolate. Peppermints. Fruit cake, Christmas lights, sword, presents, candy canes. Yeah, so the red guy gives you food. That's my favorite because I like food. And there's this guy who gives you weapons and stuff. So this is their village, I guess. Uh, I, what I think is funny is you can't. You can't, you can't light the trees on fire. It's cool, I guess. It is an ice world. There's gonna be lamps like this all around the world to light up the place. It's funny you can't light the ground and the wood, but you can't light the tree or the leaves. Burn, burn. Okay. So yeah, there's just gonna be lamps like that everywhere. This one there, there. Yeah, this is a pretty cool world, I have to say, or uh, dimension. It's big and really easy to get lost here, cause it all just looks the same. All the dimensions kind of look the same though. 
All right, I'm gonna go back and show you guys the other direction. Go, go. Sometimes it takes a while. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and go into this one. What the heck? What? Well, that's great. That's super great. That is weird. Maybe this will go? There we go. Okay. This one is kind of a big maze almost. It's not really a like terrain, like a world. And uh, you can't break any blocks in here that I've found so far. But there's a lot of mobs, and there's certain uh, blocks that you step on and they light on fire. Like they're yellow, and then when you step on them, they turn red and light you on fire. And that's not good. But there's guys you can trade with, and they give you some good stuff. And there's bunch of mob spawners everywhere it's it's kinda hard to get around or make your way around in this dimension it takes forever to load computer's slow Whew. and I assume there's like a a boss mob in there somewhere but it's just a giant box basically the world is there's a flat top and if you dig to the bottom it's just a flat bottom wow this is taking forever isn't it I might have to stop the video and uh, come back to you guys when this loads in okay well I'm gonna stop the video and I'll see you back when it loads alright I'm back uh, just loaded in took like 10 minutes to load I sat there for a while Let's see if we can uh, find something here this is a big maze actually See, this is the stuff I was talking about. If you step on the yellow, it turns red and you turn on fire. It's bad. I'll put it on easy so you guys can see some mobs, maybe. Don't touch me. Okay. Here, I'll put it on hard. These, I'm not sure if these are doors. Last time I came here, there were guys right behind the doors. The heck? Like, or, is that offside? There's just layers and layers and layers of this. And then you get to the top, and it's just like this forever. Goes on and on. Unless there's something like this, I guess. That's kind of cool. I haven't found one of those before. Nice to... <laughs> That's kind of cool. Okay, I'm gonna dig down. Or not. That still looks like under it if you dig on there. It's just a bunch of patterns and stuff. So this, unless you have like a raised mini map or a mini map mod of some sort. Oh, here, I can't get in. Okay. That was weird. 
you're gonna have a hard time finding your way around this place. I uh, see a trap. Okay, that was weird. I just got teleported back out here. Um, well, yeah. So this is the the dungeon of Arcana dimension, I guess. Normally, uh, there's people that spawn here, and they're called. Uh, one of them is Arcana. I know that. Um, I think we take like one of these and switch it to survival. I think this is the only block you can actually mine. I know I didn't give me anything, but okay. Well then, I hit the ground too hard apparently, and I can't respond. Okay. Oh, there he goes. Yeah, that's how hard it is. Losers. Okay, so, yeah. Those are the last two uh, dimensions I didn't talk about. And, yeah, that's basically it. Oh, you guys can let me know if uh, you want me to do any more stuff on this mod. I like this mod a lot, and I'd be happy to do anything if anyone wants me to. Um, yeah, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.